Hey everyone, Maurice here from Carnivore Diet app and one of the uh, questions I've been getting a lot of audience asking about is high cholesterol. Uh, when it comes to cholesterol, don't really worry about the full amount. Uh, the only thing is you want to actually check for is your oxidized LDL. If the oxidized LDL is a little bit high, then I would actually break it down and get a blood test to check your LP little a. LP little a stands for your lipoprotein small a. That number should be below 35 nanomoles per liter. If that number is a bit high, then definitely get a request to check your uh, CT calcium score to find out if there's any early stages of heart disease or any plaque buildup. So the question is, how can you reduce uh, lipoprotein small a? There's a few things you can do. One thing is you need to actually get niacin, which is vitamin B3. Now vitamin B3 is quite high in lamb liver. Uh, every um, 100 grams of lamb liver, you get about 22 uh, milligrams of niacin, which is plenty. Uh, going back to the niacin, uh, was consuming liver uh, daily, four to six ounces. My number went from 145 nanomoles per liter down to about 100 within about a 90 day period. Um, knowing me with the heart disease, don't want to take too many chances and I do want to play it safe. So after the 90 day days, I start consuming 500 milligrams of niacin at my last meal and certain uh, days throughout the week I would actually consume up to a thousand milligrams and within the 90 days after I've done the test I'm down to 45 nanomoles per liter which is amazing I will continue taking a niacin drive the number below 35 nanometer, which is that's the optimal number you should be looking for. Uh, one thing I highly um, stress about is because you're taking niacin, or if you are going to, to be taking niacin to lower your LP little a, uh, definitely get a, a monthly blood test to check your liver enzymes. Now, for the liver enzymes, I do check uh, AST and ALT, so make sure you check that number and you review it with your doctor to make sure these numbers aren't spiking. Now going back to the LP little a, the only reason the LP little a would be quite high, uh, technically the job for the LP little a is like a housekeeping for oxidized LDL. So how are we getting oxidized LDL? Either we are consuming possibly too much protein, uh, overeating, um, our insulin is spiking, we have some inflammatory responses happening. Uh, that's the only reason the LP little a would be high. Uh, I know in certain countries we don't have the testing to check for oxidized LDL. Uh, so when you check your LP little a and if that number is high that means there is some type of oxidized LDL happening in your system. Another great tip from mycarnivorecoach.com